take these fillets. And now this is a good fish had it because it's, it's, it's decently priced. And if you, you can buy it sustainably caught as well, especially from the western coast of Scotland and from parts of the North Sea as well. It's very important that you make sure you know where your fish comes from. But what I'm doing, I've got some flour, and I put in salt and I put in pepper. I'm just going to give them a nice little bath in that. Do that. Olive oil. Bang. Too much that's hot. Okay. And all you need to do... I mean, again, as usual, as I'm cooking, it's incredibly simple. There's no techniques. I don't have any techniques. This is about flavour. This is about good ingredients. But it, it really is good. So, bang this in. Like that. And oh, this is not true. This is a very, very sophisticated dish. Hugely sophisticated, <laughs> Matthew. It's the... Uh, Lovely light. I can see Mark dish. shaking with yeah. fear when it comes well, to... Well, I always think of haddock as being kind of autumnal, but it isn't at all, actually. It is summery, isn't it? That's when it's in season. I mean, it's seasonal all year. Is it? Is it all year? Yeah, yeah I think it's in February. It's a prime sign, I think. So anyway, it's nice, but I mean, smoked haddock, I mean, I've always loved smoked haddock, yes. but fresh haddock as well is, is just, it's a wonderful fish. So what I'm going to do now is make my dressing. There we go. So all I'm doing, olive oil, this is your average dressing. You want some vinegar. Your it's average all, dressing? It's your average French dressing, Matthew. <laughs> Stop <laughs> interrupting, please. Uh, a little bit of while Matthew carries on talking. Now. There we go. Okay, so that's just cooking nicely. You just want to leave it there. I'm just going to leave it actually on one side, really give it a flip at the end. So the mustard, French mustard, bang, 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 in you go. And a little squeeze of lemon just to lift it up because you want to... So that's it. Okay. Tom, I noticed that you're using um, a cos lettuce. Yes. Oh, what is the difference between... Uh, this is, a, this is a, not a trick question. What is the difference between cos and romaine? Ah, well, Matthew, they're the same yeah. thing. The same, they're called cos or romaine. It's just two different names for the same letter. Oh, that's Are you guess. sure? So, I am quite I sure. I think he's right. I think he's right. You think he's right? Yeah, I think he, he is. Ah, there you go then. Well, I think, I'm, 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 I think <laughs> one's an American name. So all I'm doing now, checking my fish, which is cooking. I'm just going to leave it really on one side, rather than keeping flipping, flipping, flopping, whatever. I'm going to leave it for about two minutes, really, to cook up. And you can see as it's going translucent, just coming up there. In the end, I'll flip it. 